It is said it's darkest before dawn, as God my hair has been wandering in the darkness for the last couple of days, not sure whether they would honor their return leg match against Supersport FC on Wednesday in South Africa. It's been unreal and I, I, I can't understand why it's taken so long and it's, it's affected the preparation, although this morning we trained at 6am. Kogalo were initially scheduled to fly out on Monday evening but were delayed by lack of visas and air tickets after the Ministry of Sports that had funded their previous away matches declined to foot the costs of the Pretoria trip. We've got a good strong squad and they've grown up, these players have grown up and it showed today and it showed all week and hopefully we can fly into South Africa tonight, not too tired, get up tomorrow a bit refreshed, go for a walk and then plan for the game against Supersport. But after all the debacle preceding the Kenya Premier League champions, Gormaya are currently airborne to South Africa's capital city, Pretoria, ahead of their return leg match of the CAF Confederations Cup against PSL strugglers, Supersport FC. This is after the Nairobi County Governor Mike Sonko came to Gormaya's rescue by offering the team 30 air tickets to facilitate their travel, together with a whooping $10,000 to facilitate their accommodation and allowances. Kogalo's match will kick off on Wednesday at 8 p.m. at the Lucas Masterpiece Moripe Stadium in Pretoria and the winner will automatically gain entry into the tournament's group stage and will also be entitled to a 27 million Kenya shillings cash reward. Gore, on the other hand, head to the game on a rich vein of form, having lost only once this season, a controversial 0-1 reverse to Esperance in the second leg of their Champions League first tie round in Tunis. A number of key players including striker Jackie Strisienge, winger Francis Kahata and Ivorian Ephraim are among those here to get entry permits to South Africa. Despite the chaos preceding this particular fixture, God Bahia retains strong hopes of progressing at the expense of South Africa's PSL strugglers, Supersport, Karen Kibet, K24 Sport.